Hello mga Matthusiast! Welcome back sa ating YouTube channel kung saan ang mat ay mas pinadadali at mas minamahal. At nandito na naman si Teacher Maria, ang inyong mat body para tulungan kayo sa mga problema nyo sa mat. For this video, ang pag-uusapan natin ay equation of the line. Pero bago ko simula ng video tutorial na ito, siguraduhin na muna mga anak ko na napindot yun na dyan ng like button. O, pindutin na! At syempre, kung bago pa lang kayo sa aming YouTube channel, pindutin nyo na rin dyan ng subscribe button. At i-hit mo na rin ang notification bell para lagi kang maging updated sa mga videos na i-upload ko. Okay na na like, na subscribe at na-hit na rin ang notification bell. Kung okay na, tara na, simulan na natin. Okay, for learning task number 1, from the given equation of the line, So, you have to find two points that will satisfy the equation, the slope and y-intercepts and the x and y-intercepts. Okay? So, identify muna natin yung two points, yung letter A natin. So, para mas madali, let's use yung 0 and 1 na lang, ha? Okay, so let's have here letter A. Okay, wait lang, ayaw magsulat. Okay. So, let's have letter A. So, suppose our x is equal to 0. Let's identify what will be our y. Okay? So, 4 and then times 0 plus 3y equals 5. So, this will be 0 plus 3y equals 5. So, magiging 3y na lang to equals to 5. And then, we have to divide it by 3. Para y na lang siya. So, y is equal to 5 over 3. Ibig sabihin, yung first point natin ay 0 and 5 over 3. Okay? Okay? And then, yung isa naman, what if our x is equal to 1? Kasi dalawang points, eh, di ba? So, suppose, suppose our uh, one of the x is 1, what is our y? So, we have here 4 times 1 plus 3y equals 5. So, this is 4 plus 3y equals 5. Para... Magiging 3y na lang na ito, lipat natin si 4 dito sa kabila. Kaya magiging 3y is equal to 5. From positive, magiging negative. So, negative 4. Kaya magiging 3y is equal to what is 5 minus 4. That's 1. And then, para maging y na lang dito, you divide it by 3. So, y is equal to 1 over 3. So, We have here naman ngayon 1 and 1 third. So, meron na tayong dalawang points. 1 and then ito, 2. Okay, next naman, ano daw hinahanap natin? Slope and y-intercept. Para makuha natin to, dapat ito matransform natin into y uh, equals mx plus b. So, 4x plus 3y equals 5. Diba? Dapat maging y is equal to mx plus b. So, eto, lipat natin sa kabila. Matitira si 3y is equal to negative 4x plus 5. And then, divide nyo siya by 3. Okay? So, y is equal to negative 4x over 3 plus 5 over 3. Ano nga yung slope natin? Di ba ito yon yung katabi ng ating x? So, that's negative 4 over 3. Ano ang y-intercept natin? Ang y-intercept natin ay ito. 5 over 3. Okay, that's for letter B. Now, for letter C, ano daw yung x-intercept and y-intercept natin? Yung y-intercept, wala ng problema. So, x-intercept na lang. So, x-intercept is just having y equals to 0. Okay? So, yung y natin magiging 0 lang siya. So, we have here, ano yung equation natin? 4x plus 3 times 0 na daw yung y. Ayan, di ba? 
equals to 5. Ito yun, di ba? 4x plus 3 times 0 equals to 5. So, you will have 4x plus 0 equals 5. And then, 4x equals 5. Kasi 4x plus 0 is 4x. And then, divide by 4. So, x is equal to 5 over 4. Ngayon, ano ngayon yung kapartner niya? Okay, you will have here 5 over 4, 0. So, ito yung x-intercept. So, let mo, x-intercept. Yung y-intercept, ito naman na eh. So, yung y-intercept natin is uh, 0 and then 5 over 3. Ito yun, no? Yung 5 over 3. Kaso yung x naman niya yung magiging 0. So, so we have this. X-intercept and then y-intercept. Sorry, na 6 6 isang space. So, dahil dyan yung number 2, ibababa ko, ha? Okay. At dahil dito pala, di ba yung sl slope natin ay negative 4, F, uh, 4 over 3? So, yung y-intercept natin, gawin din natin point, ha? So, dahil 5 over 3 to, so y-intercept is uh, 0 and then 5 over 3. Katulad nung nasa baba natin. Okay. And then yung slope is equal to negative 4 over 3. Ayan, A, B, and C. Now, let's go to number 2. Uh, 2y minus x equals 6. So, kuha ulit tayo ng points ha for letter A. So, kunin natin si x equals 0. Substitute natin para naman makuha natin si y. So, 2y minus 0 equals 6. Okay, so magiging 2y na lang to equals 6 divided by 2. So, y is equal to 6 divided by 2, 3. So, yung isang point natin ay 0, 3. Ayan, point 1. Okay, next yung isa naman, what if x is equal to 1? Ano naman yung y natin? So, we have here 2y minus yung x natin magiging 1 na lang, equal 6. O, lipat siya doon, 2y is equal to 6 minus or no, plus 1 na siya kasi negative, magiging positive na siya. And then, 2y is equal to 6 plus 1, you have 7 divided by 2. So, y is equal to 7 over 2. Kaya, ito ay 1 and then 7 over 2. O, yan yung second point natin. Now, for letter B naman, kailangan natin yung slope. Kaya, dapat maging y is equal to mx plus b yung form niya. So, 2y minus x equals 6. Lipat lang si x doon. Kaya, magiging 2y is equal to x plus 6. Yung negative, magiging positive na siya. And then, divided by 2. So, y is equal to uh, x over 2 plus 6 over 2. So, magiging y is equal to x over 2 plus 6 divided by 2. 3 na siya. Okay? So, yung slope natin is fraction tayo ha, may invisible 1. 1 half. O, yan yung slope. And then, yung ating y-intercept, so, we have 3 here, kaya magiging y-intercept, ibig sabihin nun, yung x natin ay 0 ha, 0 and then 3. Automatic yun ha, pag y-intercept, x is 0. Okay, for letter C, X and Y intercept. Dahil y, may Y na tayo, X na lang isosolve natin. Ha? X intercept is, uh, Y is 0. So, 2 times 0, kasi yung Y mo magiging 0 na. Minus X equals 6. So, 2 times 0 is 0 minus X equals 6. So, negative X na lang yan equals 6. Para maging x na lang to, you divide by negative 1, cancel na siya, so x is equal to negative 6. Okay, so eto ngayon ay magiging negative 6, 0. So, x intercept. Eto yun. Okay, and then y intercept, so i-rewrite lang natin siya. 0, 3. 
Ayan, mga anak ko, kung nagustuhan nyo ang video na ito at natulungan ko kayo kung paano nyo ba sasagutan niyang learning task number one ninyo, please i-comment yan sa comment section ha. Mga anak, I need your comments para maapit ang video na ito at makita din naman siya ng iba. Kaya please, kung nagustuhan nyo or natutunan ninyo yan, i-comment yan sa ating comment section. And don't forget to share this to your classmates para may guide din sila. At please follow our Facebook page, Love Math TV. Okay, laging tandaan, let's spread the love of math. Thank you and bye!